Hi there. I'm going to show you how to import your manuscript into Storyteller so you can get started on your story edit. First, select your file. So I'll choose my book Descent and click Next. Now I'm going to select how I formatted my manuscript. There's four choices here. I've used the word chapter at the beginning of each chapter, so I'm going to select this one. I use scene break characters in between each scene within the chapter, so I'm going to select I sure do. And my scene break character is Atilda. And now I'll continue my import, which can take up to 30 seconds. You're now on the confirmed chapters page. All you want to do here is to do a quick check that your entire manuscript imported properly. So I can see there's 46 chapters and 114 scenes. I can check out my last scene and I know this is my last scene, so I'll just click next. If it didn't import, I can re-import again. Let's back up and re-import in a different way. I'll select the same file. This time, instead of having a manuscript begin with the word chapter, I'm going to say I didn't use either chapter or heading one. I'm also going to say I do have scene break characters, but for the character, I just used a blank line. And now I'm going to continue importing. This time, when we reach confirm chapters, you can see that there is only one scene in the manuscript. Storyteller creates powerful visuals based on the scene structure of your story, so it's important to organize your story based on chapters and scenes. So let's say this was your first scene break here. You would click on the text and insert a scene break. Here you can see a scene two is here now. Now let's say this is the start of a new chapter. You would insert a chapter break and you can see chapter two has now shown up. Continue until you've organized your entire manuscript. Then the magic begins. Next, you'll see your cast of characters page and then you can begin your story edit.